upcoming Lok Sabha elections 2024 into India versus NDA, the opposition party's coalition has declared that their alliance will be called Indian National Developmental Inclusive Alliance India in short. Welcome to Telangana today, your one-stop destination for the latest news, insightful analysis and engaging stories from the heart of Telangana and beyond. Today, we will discuss India and the role it is expected to play in the forthcoming elections. First, let us get cracking with how the name India came to be. On July 17th and 18th, 26 opposition parties attended a key meeting in Bengaluru. This was the second time these parties met to map out their course for the forthcoming elections. The members decided that the previous name United Progressive Alliance, popularly called the UPA, should be replaced. A bunch of names were thrown around at first, but according to reports, India, which was suggested by Mamata Banerjee, was picked up. While there was initial confusion over what D stands for in India, whether democracy or developmental, it was later made clear that it is developmental. During the discussions, Nitish Kumar reportedly questioned how an opposition alliance could be named India. He also expressed reservations about an acronym with the letters NDA in it. Left leaders were also reportedly hesitant and suggested different alternatives. But because most parties were on board with the name, Nitish Kumar and the left parties also agreed. Apart from finalizing the name, here are some other key points from this meeting. First things first, all the tall leaders from different political parties said that the NDA had to go as they were hurting the democracy of the country. The alliance also demanded the implementation of caste census while asserting that they have come together to defeat the hatred and violence being manufactured against minorities. Not just minorities, but also rising crimes against women, Dalits, tribals and Kashmiri pundits. Congress President Malikarjun Karge, who chaired the closed-door meeting, said that like-minded opposition parties will work together to foster an agenda of social justice, inclusive development and national welfare. The next meeting of these parties will be held in Mumbai after the monsoon session of parliament. What do you think of this latest alliance? Do let us know in the comments below. And don't forget to like, share and subscribe to Telangana today for more such videos.